so we're back with another vlog today. I feel like that's just what we love filming. You guys get to see what we get up to in our days. We're not actually sure what we're going to do today. We were going to go to Lakeside. I think we still will. This has just arrived. It's a sofa bed and we're going to unbox it. I don't know how we managed to get up the stairs. He literally just like carried it on his shoulder. So he made that look so easy. finished getting ready i feel like that took so long i feel like the longest part of the day is getting ready i hate like doing my hair and i don't even like the it way takes up like most of the day yeah well, it's not that late it's only half one yeah, so we've done our hair and makeup now i'm going to decide what to wear today and luckily we've got white fox to help us with this and we've literally got a massive box of clothes so we're just going to show you guys what we picked up i've already decided what i'm wearing today um so this is what I'm wearing. I'm just wearing this little two-piece from White Fox. It's like wide leg and it's like really comfy. I just feel like this is like perfect thing to wear shopping. In my box, I've got loads of dressy things and we're going out on Friday night with the girls. So I'm just gonna let you guys help me decide what to wear because I've got so many nice dressy pieces in here. Okay, so the first thing I picked up was this little set. It's called Follow Me Strapless Crop, and I got it in this charcoal colour. Reminds me of like Clueless, you know the film? Yeah. Or like Wild Child or something like that. Yeah. Um, it's got like this little belt, and it's just this like little cropped top, and then it's got the skirt. But I'll try it all on. You can help me decide what to wear. This is the next thing I picked up. How unreal is this? It's like this little corset, but it's like mesh, and it's like mesh material, but it looks so nice on. This is called the enlighten me bustier i've got everything in a size small i think this would be really cute with some cargos i've got two pairs of cargos i was thinking about wearing but i've actually got the corsets in oh, the yeah. other colors so we've got all three colors now yeah so nude white and the black i really like the nude color yeah it's actually really nice like sort nice. of like mink color these look so nice on got two pairs of cargos that i could pair this top with so the first pair are these these are called never blending cargo pants in khaki got them in a size small i just love a parachute cargo at the moment you can dress them up with like dressier tops and they just look so cool and these are so cute and they've got the little tie bit here and then the cuffed bottoms can you get them in another color as well yeah i don't know if it's the same style but i've also got i think yeah it must be the same yeah, style i don't know if you can see the difference in the color these are more like greenier and this is like a lighter shade. I don't know what ones I prefer, so you need to help me. But yeah, these ones are in the light grey, which but they aren't a light no. grey. And They're I would like say a light that's green. khaki either. No, I'd say that's a light green and this is like a... Mint colour. Yeah, mint colour. I actually got them in the black as well, which I've been wanting some black parachute trousers for ages now. And these ones are so nice. I actually wore the khaki ones, because I've also got them the other day, bowling and... They just are so comfy and just like easy to wear. I got mine in extra small and they fit really nicely. And they've got this like drawstring in so you can pull it in around your waist. That's another option for Friday. And then I've got this, which I feel like it's quite out there. And our town, we don't really dress up, do we, that much. So I don't know if I'll be able to wear this, but I'm just going to show you anyway because it's unreal. Can't wait to wear this to like an event or something. So it's called No Drama Bustier and I got it in a size small. I really wish I got it in a bigger size because it is really, really tight. So I think I'm going to have to pick this up in a bigger size, but it's so nice. This is what it looks like. Obviously, you'll see on the try-on clip, but... It's just unreal. And then these are the trousers that match. Here to stay pants in a size small. Look how cool the design is on these. What is I it? I just think they're sick. Oh, I think they say white just... fox. Look, it's got Where? white. Oh my god. Yeah, I think they do say white fox on, but so how cool. cool are these? And then together, it sort of looks like a whole a jumpsuit, jumpsuit, but yeah. you can obviously make it not look like a jumpsuit if you want to pull the trousers down. Honestly, I can't wait to wear this. Probably won't be for Friday, but I'll wear it another time. I also picked up some basics, which I'm just going to show you. So I picked up this Learn the Ropes crop top in black. This is what it looks like. It's just got the cutout. You've got this, haven't you, in a different colour? Yeah, I've got it in charcoal. Oh, gray. yeah. I think that's why I got this, because I remember seeing yours and thought that was really nice. 
nice. And I needed to pick up some more basics for my wardrobe because I don't have any basic tops. This would be cute if just like some jeans or some cargos. But um, I could wear that because it's quite... Yeah. Could like dress it up with some jewellery and yeah. stuff. So that's that top. And then I got this little set. This is called Take Me There Ribbed Baby Tee. Got that in a size small. And then it comes with the little shorts. I just feel like this is such a nice piece just to lounge in the house in. Like, you know, you don't know what to wear, so you just want to chuck something on. Yeah. And it's really comfy. It's such good such, quality. Yeah, as well. I say, such good quality. I've got this top in the white and I wear it all the time. And loads of people ask me where it's from and it's just a plain white top, but it must look good quality. Yeah. On. Like, it's so thick. They've just got the elasticated waistband, so they're really stretchy. You could even dress this up, like, with a big blazer. chunky blazer with some boots. I could even wear that Friday, you know? That could be an option. Then the last two things I picked up was this top. This is called Who Blessed Crop in Steel. This actually comes as a set. Do you have the set, but in a different colour? Oh, That's the skirt. Little skirt. Yeah. yeah. I really wanted this skirt with this, but um, I didn't get it. So I'm going to have to pick that up in our next White Fox haul because the material of this is so it's really soft. soft, isn't it? Like, imagine wearing this on a night out. Yeah. It's so comfy. Yeah, I've got that in the grey and then the black as well. Last thing I picked up was this top. It's called Wishing Well Top in the size small. So it's just a plain red top. Oh, that's really and then nice. It's got, yeah, and then it's got like the cut out back. I don't know if you can see. Um, and then it has like the little lace bits you tie up at the back. But because I've got red dunks i thought this would be really cool like, even if i wanted to wear a more casual piece i could wear this with some like black cargos and then my red and white dunks yeah this could be an option too and i don't know because i like everything <laughs> but yeah that was my last piece but yeah guys let me know what you think looks the best on the try on clips and help me decide because we're going out friday and i need some help <laughs> i actually have a piece from white fox on and i haven't taken this off since i got it i've been wearing it the whole weekend and last two days but it's literally just a tracksuit in this like gray color and then it's got the white fox logo it's like a bubble print and it feels like really cool and then i love the back of the hoodie look how sick this is obviously the matching joggers i just feel like if you're looking for a nice quality tracksuit then go to white fox and look on their website because they've got so many nice ones they're like the perfect like style like the hood's really nice they're cuffed at the bottom pockets drawstring oversized literally unreal I really like hoodies but then i feel like sometimes you just want like a sweater i picked this one up so it's in this like mushroom sort of color and then it's got the print here and then the print on the back which i really like it says season 13 white fox which is really cool. I actually got this in a medium slash large, but I don't think you need to size up in these because this is really big now. But to wear like round the house, just like lounging in, it's going to be so nice. And then I also picked up another hoodie. This is the off stage hoodie. And this is just a black hoodie, but it's got the like bubble in like more of like a charcoal grey colour. And then it's got the white fox print on the back but, on the new sofa. <laughs> yeah, I just really wanted a black hoodie so can't wait to wear that and then I also got the same set as Kira but I got it in the beige and I just really like this like you said it's like clueless vibes they're just the mini skirt and the crop top but you'll see it on in the try on clip so this could be one of my options for Friday so it's actually a bandeau dress with the like bolero sleeves this is called the in full bloom long sleeve mini dress and i got it in extra small it's in like this off white color it's like a ribbed knitted material it's like really stretchy and like soft i love the separate sleeve trend at the moment so i definitely feel like this could be an option and obviously this will keep you quite warm and then i just picked up a few tops so this is kind of similar to the dress but it's just like a bandeau top with the sleeves and this is so soft if you could feel this it's such a nice material what? <laughs> <laughs> it's literally unreal this is called the forgetting you ribbed long sleeve crop and i got it in extra small i just think these look really nice with like cargos or even jeans yeah and then another ribbed knitted top in cream but like you can never have enough of these in autumn winter especially like long sleeve ones but like, this is just a long sleeved plain basic top and I like the hem, the way that it like goes up. I think that's really nice. And this is called Keep It Coming Long Sleeve Crop. Yeah, with jeans, cargos, skirt, literally anything. So easy to wear. And then the last two items, I just got this charcoal grey plain short sleeve top, which is called Two Blessed Tea. But yeah. Is that again, the same as mine? 
Uh, yeah, it is. Is it? I think. It's yeah, too blessed. Yeah. Same material. I think they all have matching mini skirts, but I just love these tops. They're just so easy to wear. And then lastly, I picked up another top, and this is actually just a plain black like a boxy crop t-shirt. I saw this trend with like a long sleeve top underneath. Oh really? Yeah, which looks really nice. But yeah, I got this in an extra small. And I had it in white as well. But this is just like an easy top to wear. But yeah, I love all the pieces we got from White Fox. Definitely go and check their website out because they've got unreal pieces. I feel like White Fox is definitely one of my favourite clothing brands. Yeah. We do actually have a discount code, so we'll put it on the screen and make sure you go and use that to get some money off your order. Oh, I forgot, I've got some socks as well. Oh, cute. White Fox do socks. These are actually really cute socks. I always like white, fresh socks. Yeah. This is what they look like. Got like a little print there. Yeah, cute. Yeah, let us know in the comments what you think we should wear for Friday because I really do need the help. We're off to Lakeside now. We're going to do a bit of shopping. We want to get some new cushions for this new sofa. Also, we're going to go get? to Stradivarius because yeah. we might do a haul for you if they've got some nice pieces in. And I need to get some new makeup bits and stuff. Yeah. Amy's going to try the new <gasps> McDonald's yeah, burger. I'm really hungry. I had breakfast at like nine. I Probably might just get some McDonald's to Yeah, so Even we're gonna get Mackey's on the way. I literally had McDonald's twice this weekend. How bad is that? I've already tried the new chicken burger, but Amy can give it a, re yeah. a, re a, it a re re review. McCrispy. Yeah, the McCrispy. Guys, we're at McDonald's. Mackey dish. I don't know if to get a wrap or a, a McChicken. Big decisions. I don't know if to add cheese. I'm not gonna add cheese actually. No, because you need to tell them what it's actually Hi, like. Hi, right, can I get the McCrispy? What's the wrap of the day? It's bacon barbecue. Oh no. Can I get a McChicken with cheese? Um, no, can I get a um, McChicken sandwich with cheese? Lovely. It's going to be good. Thank you. Oh my god, my car. It's definitely not right. Listen to my car. Here's oh, your McCrispy. I really wish I got McCrispy now. <laughs> Gonna try this McCrispy. I feel like it's got loads of lettuce in. I can't remember the last time I got McDonald's. I feel like in every vlog we get it, so it looks like we have it a lot. Yeah, bun looks so good, doesn't it? Look at that bun. Look at that. You'll like that because of the chicken. Whoa, it's not mayo in that. It tastes like KFC burger, I think. Mmm. Yum. Mmm. Oh my god. I think that would be good with cheese in it as well. Mmm. No, it's unreal. We're on our way to Lakeside now. I think the shop's shut at 10. I hope so, because it's currently quarter to three. So if they shut at five, we're a bit doomed because we're about 40 minutes away from Lakeside. I really want to get that cushion, the knot cushion. Mm. I really hope they have it. What colours do they have it in? They had like a nude one and then a cream. Imagine if the cream doesn't match up with the cream oh, sofa. Yeah. It's really hard to match creams. Mm. Anyway, we'll see. So, we'll see you at Lakeside. Hagrid! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's nice to sit down. <laughs> We're back in the car and we just realised we haven't vlogged, which is typical of us. We're supposed to be doing like a shopping video, but we didn't really want to show you everything because obviously we're doing a haul on all the clothes that we've bought. So we didn't want to give anything away and show you all the stuff that we're buying. So you just have to wait and watch that video, but yeah. we need to go and get cushion steel because we went into Primark and we wanted that um, twisty not ball one. knot thing. They didn't have they it. They didn't have it. Every time we go into Primark, we see it. Yeah. And this one time we actually want to buy it because we've got a new sofa. It wasn't in there. We're going to go to like the retail park bit with like the B&M, HomeSense, I think it's got. It's got quite a lot of shops over there, so hopefully they'll have some. I feel like creams are really hard colour to get. Yeah, they Oh, are. they've got the range, they might have some. We went to Starbucks and Kira got a ice white mocha with hazelnut syrup and then he made the drink wrong and then made her drink and then asked if she wanted this one. No, so do you know what happened? He okay, called out a drink. name and was like, I thought he said Kira because last time I got my Starbucks, they said the name They said wrong. Kira, Kira or something. He called out Terry. But he sounded like he said Kira because he was like Kira. No, he sounded and then like, like Kerry. Kerry. Went up and he went, "Here's a blah yeah, blah was like blah." Free drink. And I was like, "Oh, that's not mine." And he was like, oh, "What's your name?" I was like, "Kira." And he was like, "Oh no, I said Terry." I was like, oh, "So embarrassing." Don't you know, you think, "Oh my god!" Like, <laughs> just, 
shoot me now, that was so embarrassing. So I walked away and then I walked back and he was like, oh, I'm sorry, I've done the wrong order. Yeah, and but then, it's more embarrassing for him. Yeah, bless him. And then that's why I think he gave you the free one. Yeah. Because I think he felt really embarrassed. Because normally they just chuck it away. Yeah. But guys, all of our bags are in the back, as you can see. Where do we go? Primark, H&M. Australia and Bear. They've got Pull and Bear at Lakeside now. Stradivarius, Zara. What do you think goes to H&M home? Oh. <laughs> That's where we was no. meant to take you. It's like a new H&M home. We didn't even go in there. <laughs> <laughs> Off we go to our favourite store, B&M. <laughs> oh, pretty, pretty chicken. Ooh. Nando's. <gasps> Nando's? <laughs> it doesn't look like Nando's. <laughs> yeah, it does. No. Are they gonna... <gasps> yes. Oh my God, yes. Sofa. Well, both not the same cream. I think that is. Or is it more white this than that? It's more white. Oh. That that does look nice though. It does, doesn't it? And it feels really Where's the cream? Oh, here's cream cushions. That's cute. Oh, yeah, that Two for twelve well. pounds. Oh, Bloody bargain! <laughs> So far, yeah. I thought you said she wanted you. She wanted you to get just the cases. I know she did, but where are we going to find them? Yeah, that's not bad for two for time. No, that's so good. What other ones? <gasps> What's that? They bigger oh, ones. Bigger. <gasps> wow. Oh, wow. God, there's loads. <gasps> They're nice. They're more white though. Yeah, but that's. That's what we need. Oh. I really like them. That is nice. That one. But then do you go for the two for twelve pound <clears throat> ones or oh, yeah. twelve pounds? Yeah, that. Oh. No, sorry, Kira, these these look cheap. What ones? Oh now looking at them. Look. <laughs> 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 oh, Okay guys, 200 pounds later, and we have our b and stuff. Oh my god, my boot's full. <gasps> oh oh shit. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Guys, we broke down. It's actually not even funny. Oh my god. Basically, Amy's car's and we've broken down but luckily we haven't broken down on a roundabout i think my clutch has gone but i thought there was something weird with my car because the clutch felt really sticky i had to pull over because I, I couldn't change gear and then i was like oh it's fine I've got, I've got it into first and then we got to the roundabout couldn't change gear I had to stop at the roundabout then could get into gear again pulled off the first exit and now we're stuck and i literally can't put my foot down on the clutch and I was panicking a minute ago because Immy pulled onto the middle of the road and I was on the edge of the road and I, I thought someone was going to hit me and I started going, oh my god, I don't know what to do! Oh my god. Why has this oh. got to happen? We, we're literally five minutes away from home. I said just like, put it into first gear and just try. And, and I now her clutch can't. isn't even moving. Why is it? Just slow down, you and we've got all of this stuff in our car as well. So it's not like we can even just walk home and just sort of leave your car somewhere if we can try and move it a bit because we've got all this stuff. Hey okay, guys, we're home and we're safe. We made it back. We made it. Mum picked not us up. Not in the car though. Yeah, the car is stranded. Cherry has been left. The road, but she has now died. She's now died. <laughs> just grab it, didn't fine, crash, like break down on the motorway. Yeah, I was away. freaking out. I'm so that was really we scary. Down. Oh, like, no. Imagine if like you broke down. Um, <laughs> Yeah, I know, Rusty. Rusty. Imagine if you broke down like in the middle of the road, or like on a bend. I did. Broke down a roundabout. I mean, like, on a bend. Yeah. But yeah, it Not is really now like currently nine o'clock, and we're just about to make dinner. So we've got Hello Fresh. We've got either chicken korma, teriyaki pork with rice, or. 
crumbed chicken schnitzel with schnitzel. <laughs> mustard cream sauce and tender stem. I really fancy this. Do you? Oh, oh. We had chicken last night. Oh, this. I really don't fancy that. Really? Yeah. That's the one thing I fancy. Oh. I just have what you want. What about chicken korma? Yeah. Start cooking that now, and then we're going to put the new. Oh, we haven't even shown you what we've got. No, we'll, we'll show you, after. but um, we've got something we're going to put up in the video. Come and dish up dinner with me. Come and dish up dinner Come with me. Come and dish up dinner with me. These are chicken korma, guys. Let's do a taste test, see if it's good. We haven't had a chicken korma from HelloFresh before, so I hope this is good. Never actually made a homemade korma. Mmm. Mmm. That's real good. We're going to eat this and then we're going to put the thing up that you haven't seen yet in the bathroom. Do a bit of DIY. Yeah. This is what we are building. It's basically a bathroom unit thing. It's not that interesting, but no, it's practical and we're excited for it. So we're just <laughs> sad, really. We are really sad. Oh no! This looks look so how many parts. Imagine if this doesn't fit as well. We don't even. Know. You won't be able to take it back. Oh my god! Is that a joke? This probably gonna take us about five hours, but oh, it's got like numbers and everything. Number twelve. One, six, three, two, one. I don't need that. Why? Just in case we just fit back. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell you my problems, meditating my silence. But I keep pushing my pen, rotating my stylus. Brokenness feeling like sin, not no breath, low dollar. Used to be left on red, now all the girls go holler. Now all the girls go follow. All the fake friends gon' pile up. I need peace to borrow, get that shit right back tomorrow. Somehow all the fans go bravo, smile so much to hide my sorrow. Stay the shaky in Verado. We've got all of our pieces built together. Guys, it's currently quarter past twelve. <clears throat> We've just finished making it. Baking. <laughs> making it. I can't believe this. It's taken so long. I don't even know what time we started doing it. I think it was like ten. It took us two hours to do this little thing for the bathroom. But we've made it, and we did it. So it's fine. It's not like it just falls apart. Well, it doesn't fit. Let's see if it fits. Yeah. Hello, it's perfectly working doors. Oh my god, yes. Our camera died, but this is what the end result looks like, and we're very proud. And if you think it won't fit stuff in, it does because it goes like up and under. So we've got like so much more space now. We're happy about that. We've got so much more space. <laughs> Guys, uh sorry. It literally looks like another head that's grown on my head. I think she's had an allergic reaction to No, spot. I just think the stress of bloody breaking down has broken me out. <gasps> Where? It's huge. I've never had a spot that big. It's like a lump. Look at that. And it Put hurts. Soda cream on it here. really hurts in me oh. when you touch it. Who so are you going to have that at the weekend? Oh. Friday night. <gasps> now you know how it feels when I get spots. She Shit. never gets spots. She has like the nicest skin in the world. No, I don't. Guys, does anyone else have a sibling and they've got scars on their face from their sibling? Because me and Imi have scars. Just... Or did we just hate each other when we were younger? Yeah. We are off to bed now because it is currently... Quarter to one. Quarter to one. And it is very late and it's a Tuesday. Got a lot to do tomorrow. We need to get up early. So we need to end this vlog here. I hope you guys did enjoy anyway. And make sure you look out for our B&M haul because we are going to be filming that tomorrow and we're really excited because we picked up some really nice pieces yeah. remember to give it a like if you did enjoy it and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already thank you guys for watching and we will see you in our next video, video. bye <laughs>